Real Housewives Ultimate Girls Trip Season 3 has brought together some of your favorites from across the franchises, but will the drama tear them apart? We will find out, but there's one thing we know for sure. Alexia Napola and Marisol Patton are ready for some fun. The duo has brought the bro show to Thailand. Take a look. <laughs> snorkeling? Mm -hmm. I would like you to snorkel. Marisol loves to snorkel, especially with my hair waving. <laughs> <laughs> they have the hot tub too. Did he say hot sake? Hot tub. Hot uh, tub. Yeah, jacuzzi on the yeah, board. I think your stomach thing is affecting your hearing a little bit too. Maybe warm sake would help. No, nimbente. It's it's boiled rice. No, and you keep telling me to eat rice. Got to do it right. Getting the show back on the road, the bro show, the bro show. <laughs> First of all, are you feeling better? Yes, thank you. Yeah, <laughs> thank yeah. goodness. Yeah, Alexia, you only went into this knowing Marisol and Giselle. Was that better or worse? Um, I think it was better, you know, honestly, not really knowing the girls well. I came in with an open heart, an open mind. I was, you know, super excited to meet all of them. I really hadn't watched their shows so much. And I didn't want to judge them by their performance or who they were on their shows, you know, back home. So I was just showing up to have a good time to meet all these women that were in the same journey as me. And I knew we had that bond. No matter what, we had that bond yeah. in being housewives. Mm -hmm. yes. right. And uh, speaking of bonds, it seems like you developed a lot. Marisol, we saw you get very emotional when talking about your mom. And you have these conversations sometimes. You could see that you guys are really connecting. Uh -huh. There's a kinship that develops, I would imagine. Do you keep in touch with a lot of the women? Uh, yeah, yeah, we do. We um, kept in touch with Heather, all of them, Candace, Portia, Giselle, yeah. Yeah, we have a group text with Giselle and Portia. Mm -hmm. I was recently in, in Salt Lake City. I reached out to the girls. We actually ended up seeing Meredith because there was a blizzard and um, I couldn't see Heather or Whitney, but they're all lovely. They're all super sweet. And yeah. It was a really great experience. So yeah, nice. we're all forever connected. And what about for the two of you living in such co close quarters? Could I guess make or break your friendship? How's the relationship right now? Oh, well, right now it's great. It's great. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> Give us an hour. <laughs> it's always good, you know. We fight like sisters. We love like sisters. Yeah. And, you know, we just. You're not getting rid of me. Right. <laughs> I don't want to get rid of you. Good. I'm here. No, you could tell that you're genuine friends. Obviously, you worked through it. <laughs> Let's talk about the drama. There was a lot of drama this season. There were explosive arguments from the yacht to shady comments at dinner. Was there any that made you uncomfortable or were you like, whoa, this is too much? Um, well, you know, we're professionals. <laughs> <laughs> and we see this kind of thing. But um, I thought the, the Salt Lake City watching cousins fight like that was, it was hard. It was a lot. Mm -hmm. It was heavy. Yeah, and for me also, Candace was also a little bit difficult to watch because she, you know, I kind of relate to her a little bit because I cry a lot when I'm like really upset. Mm. So, you know, she would go from like, you know, crying to like, you know, screaming and, you know, that, losing that control. Like, I know what that feels like so I can relate to them and I didn't want to do it. Mm. I was like, you know, I've had a tough season. I'm just like, you know, going into like the strip to have fun. And you did, did you? Did yes, you have fun? I had a blast. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. I had a really good time. Mm -hmm. Now, after doing this, what other franchise would you each choose to be on if you had to pick a different from Miami? You mean to go on the trip with? No, just to be on another show. I love my city. I don't want to go anywhere. I want to stay with Miami. Okay. Oh, well, you can have that answer? <laughs> no. <laughs> you have, well, to, you pick. have to pick. I have to pick. Okay, yeah. we're always on that spot. We always have to pick something. <laughs> Let me help you. Because I always have yeah, the same tell answer. Really tell us. No. No. no, I always have the same answer, but they're not even on the air now. So New York, oh, New York. I love New York. I love Lou, Sonia, the gang. Yeah, the like, I love all those New girls. York. Okay, the the, yeah, that's Jill, fair. all those girls. Yeah, that's fun. I would not have guessed that. Love mm -hmm. to hear that. Um, let's talk about the Miami reunion. Emotions ran high. Are you able to work things out in the off season, or do you save it for when you get back to filming? Is it worth fixing some of these relationships? Hmm. Um. You know. Some yes, some no. <laughs> some yes, some no. You know? Some I want to, some I don't. So we'll have to stay tuned in. Yeah, I, I, like know. who? Huh? Like who? I don't know. Take a guess. <laughs> <laughs> this is a morning show. We have to keep it, all right, keep all it right. fluffy and light. Now, Alexia, you did, you did say that you like how Giselle asks a lot of questions. Would you take some of that 
back to Miami? Absolutely. Yeah. I learned a lot from each and every one of the girls. Mm -hmm. And that's one thing I learned from Giselle and from Portia as well. You know, Portia's more playful. So I think I'm going to incorporate a little bit of both of them. Mm -hmm. right. And um, yeah, and I'm going to start asking questions because, you know, I feel like I'm so honest and I'm so vulnerable and, mm -hmm. you know, I'm so transparent and I don't feel the rest of the girls on my cast are. So it's going to be somebody's job to start asking some questions. Mm -hmm. Bring it. All right, well, I'm going to ask you one more question. Yeah. <laughs> How do you think the rest of the Miami girls would get along with the cast of Ultimate Girls Trip? Hmm. Hmm. I think some of them would Someone. get along yeah. mm -hmm. with Someone. the rest of, of the girls. Yeah. No, I think, you know, like always, like every time there's a group of women, there's always going to be some, they get along and some they don't. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. We can't wait. You can catch a new episode of Real Housewives Ultimate Girls Trip this Thursday on Peacock. Thank you both so much. Thank you for having us. Thank you for having us. You can smell fantastic. Yes. <laughs>